He's half man, half woman. It's Gary. I wanna hip you to the teeth. Mm-mm, it's Gary, baby. All right, y'all, Greenville, South Carolina, make some noise. All right, y'all, listen, man, we are at Clemson University's Men of Color National Summit. Man, listen, I'm so excited to be here. Greenville, where you at? Building. Gary got the tea and the color of the day. Y'all been waiting on the tea? Here's Gary. <laughs> Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Thursday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in the celebrity news, y'all. It's a very sad day, y'all, for um, ABC's Tamron Hall. Y'all watch, anybody watch the Tamron Hall show? Oh, yeah. It was so sad. I don't know if y'all heard the shocking news, but it was reported that yesterday Tamron was going to record her show, and they're saying, honey, she was cooking and set a fire on the set, and they had to cancel the show. They said she was cooking some oxtails, and it was a grease fire in the set of the kitchen and a brief evacuation of her Upper West Side ABC studio where Tal was taping the show. Now, they said the people from The View went into the studio, and they saw the fire. Whooping was saying that it wasn't them that set the fire, but a lot of people are saying, though, that all black people don't know how to cook oxtails, and they shouldn't do it on their show. <laughs> but nevertheless, they said Taryn did that, so we got to keep How do you set a kitchen on fire making oxtails? So she probably was searing them. Because sometimes you have to sear the meat before you actually boil. So she probably was searing them and had, uh, you know, that grease probably got caught on fire or whatever. I don't know, but they saying alleged, honey, that was a sad situation. And all the people had to evacuate. But that's not a good look because somebody could have lost their life, honey, in what, that kitchen. Was she cooking them during the show? Evidently so. She was cooking probably before, for breakfast before they started the show. Oxtails for breakfast? Girl, people eat them for breakfast, honey. <laughs> don't y'all they, eat oxtails for breakfast? Yeah, when they good. Oh, y'all don't? When they good at night and you want some leftovers early in the morning, oxtails ain't bad with, a, with some uh, Hungry Jack biscuits. <laughs> yes, Lord. I mean, that's a sad situation, though. I mean, but I feel bad for her staff because they had to all rush It home. was oxtails for sure. They, they say it could have been oxtails. They don't know if it was oxtails or pig feet. Oh, he done made that up. What? <laughs> or pig feet. <laughs> yeah, I ain't lying. You know she wasn't cooking no oxtail. <laughs> I don't, know. I don't I, think they have a kitchen in the back. I know the kitchen they be in the front when they preparing stuff in front yeah. of the audience. So how, how do they burn something when the audience mm-hmm. is and everybody watching? But, you know, all women don't know how to cook oxtails. And, you know, Tamron is kind of, you know, she's more of a... She's from Texas. She's from you know Texas. they eat oxtails in Texas? She's from oh, Texas. Yeah, but she may not know how to cook because she went to college. Most girls that go to college don't know how to cook oxtails. Really? Huh? Oh, my God, Gary. You're hanging yourself. Yeah, you don't learn how to, you really don't learn how to cook oxtails until you get uh, almost 40. Don't nobody really? in their 30s be making oxtails. I don't know anyone in their 30s mm. make oxtails. You get them when you can start getting older. Uh, that's yeah, not, well, that's uh, not true. Well, we go, Really? Oh, yes. You know people in their 20s can yes. cook oxtails. If, if you got a grandmama and a mama and a family that cook, you learn how to make all that stuff when you're young. Okay. Really? Oh. Ooh. Now, Brad, right. Brad make a good dressing. She don't know how to make no oxtails? I sure do. Oh, yeah. see there? Nah. <laughs> Moving on. And now this, news, y'all. this is a sad story, y'all. Disney actress Halle Bailey, y'all, they're saying she's officially a single mother. They say she split up with her rapper baby's father, DDG, y'all. Now, we were talking about this backstage, and they're like, she didn't break up with her. He's a rapper. You think he's going to stay around forever? So, and she's a Disney mean? girl. What that mean? Jay-Z a rapper? He's still with Beyonce. Oh, he is? But um, but she's she's a princess. She's a Disney princess. She's a cute little young lady and stuff. You know he was gonna be. And then he already cheated on her once before when he was trying to um text and make his old ex girlfriend, honey, um Pink Pony. What's her name? Um, what was her name? Ooh, the, the, Pink Ruby Pony. Rose. Was Pink Rose. Yeah. yeah. So he was cheating with her. So I Pink mean, Pony is a strip club in Atlanta. Oh, well, them too. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I can wear that too. <laughs> Across from his winners. But I, <laughs> oh Lord. but I feel sorry for her, though. I mean, you know, I mean, she should have known. I'm, he just didn't seem like the right guy. Is he a big time rapper? They seemed happy when they were together, Gary. Yeah, they seemed happy. And poor thing, honey, not Hallie. She's a single mom, honey. So bless her spirit. So we got to keep her lifted up in our prayers. She got to find her Russell mommy. Wilson. He might still be there for the kids. But if he ain't there 24-7, she's a single mama. But why? She going to end up with somebody like Russell Wilson. It's, it's like lot, Sierra a did. a lot of Russell Wilsons out there. Sure is. That, that, that's out there. We waiting. We be waiting. There's a lot of us like yeah. Russell Wilson. 
Yeah, 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 I, I don't sure. know about a lot, Ricky. Maybe like five of y'all, but not uh-huh. a lot. Maybe like five, not a lot. Really? No, it ain't a whole lot of Russell Wilsons out there. Yes, it, it, you yeah. don't think so? Yeah, that's uh. like he like he like a unicorn. Well, we get an older right, ladies. Version. Yeah, I mean, you got me, you got Rock T. We, 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 you know what I'm saying? Got child what? You married? You married too? We, 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 but we like Russell. Yeah, we Wilson like the Russells types. though. Ricky is the Russell, the Russell Wilson. Wilson. Ricky ain't married, ain't honey. If um, Halle Bailey available, Ricky call her. She's too young. I can't. She's too young. I ain't gonna uh, sleep with no woman, and then she up watching Peppa Pig. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no. Sitting up there naked, naked, eating a bowl of cereal with milk running down her chest, watching Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hell no. Something don't feel right about that. <laughs> My color today, y'all, is Dusty Rose. <laughs> on the high end, you say Dusty Rose, and on the low end, just look at Special K's wonderful outfit, honey. Dusty Rose. Put Dusty in Rose. That's a beautiful outfit. One time, Special K. Y'all yeah. give it up for Gary <laughs> with the team. Yes, sir. We are live from Clemson University's Men of Color National Summit. And listen, uh, coming up, man, we got your little wake-up shout-outs. We're going to do the wake-up shout-outs in our... Uh, you know, uh, and two NFL stars is going to be joining us. We got all of that coming up next. Ricky Smiley Morning Show.